over the last several years, I have learned quite a bit about how our justice system works. It is not what I thought it was. And I'm here today to share you some of those experiences to help you get through this horrible time. When we're suffering from trauma, depression, and PTSD, and the truth is, making an innocent mistake, we can land ourselves in trouble with the law. Now, in my last video, I discussed um, how you can't record a conversation in some states, like Nevada, without the other person's permission. This restriction reminds us how the legal system restricts actions that we might think are harmless or justified. Now, these laws are designed to protect people's rights, but they can feel frustrating when we're grieving and want to act. And believe me, it's so easy to make a mistake. Now today, I wanna to speak about another crucial legal restriction. Now it's here in Nevada, but it's also in other states. One that directly affects how we handle the aftermath of tragedies, like losing a loved one to a drunk driver. As of September, 2024, Nevada passed a law that prevents us from publicly sharing the mugshot of someone arrested, arrested for DUI until they have been convicted, which could mean years. This means that even if the person responsible for taking your loved one's life has been arrested, we are legally prohibited from posting their mugshots until they've been found guilty in court, arrested, not convicted. Also, be careful about using the name on social media. Again, you can get in trouble. Now, this concept is incredibly frustrating, but we, the victims, must follow it to avoid unnecessary legal trouble. We can't afford to make mistakes, but we will make them in the process because breaking the law, even by accident, we're not going to be forgiven just because we didn't know, just because we were suffering trauma, just because we're in depression. My best advice is to contact an attorney in your area for help before you do anything like this. Because every state is different in everything, as a matter of fact. Always, always, always remember the criminal has all the rights and the DA is working for the state, not for you. This is our reality. Now this doesn't mean we're powerless. While we must be cautious about sharing mugshots or names, we can still make our voices heard. We can channel our grief and frustration into advocating for stronger DUI laws and raising awareness about the consequences of drunk driving.